Wearable technology, both in awareness and participation, is growing year on year. It's one of the fastest market trends. And there's many forms which has helped that happen. On top of MyZone, there's other chest straps, there's wearable wrist. The genius of MyZone is how digestible the information is. Being able to look at your heart rate as a percentage and change in colour, that is what the consumer wanted in the first place. Something that they can relate to and get the most out of themselves. Yeah, so originally I was training uh, kind of two times a week, uh, but once I got to my zone, I figured it was, it just, it helped me get the motivation behind what I was doing. I could set some goals um, and it really helped me track where I was up to it and really progress my fitness. Hello. We really love our live streaming. We use it to engage our members so that they can see exactly where they're at with their workout. And when we have our new members, we really love how we can see that they're not overexerting themselves and really just taking it at a good steady pace for their full workout so they really get to enjoy their workout rather than making it um, such an effort for them. My zone, always been a team sport girl and coming into the high low and my zone still had that competitive nature. I was able to compete with myself, see how many points I got in the previous session and then also have a little cup on the board and see who's working harder than me. With our MyZone effort points, we look at get the members to check out the screens, see where we're at at halfway, and our goal for our second half of the workout is to double those MyZone effort points. A bit of friendly competition, and as a trainer, it makes our life so much easier. I like MyZone because I can see how hard I'm working. It keeps me accountable and makes me work harder.